are not a pastry. That is coming up today on day nine of the 21 day approach to healing the gut. If you are ready, then let's go. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Sarah K. Hoffman, AKA A Gutsy Girl, and I am here today to share with you day nine of our 21 day journey. I'm super excited for this day because it's very short, to the point, and I think you're going to love it. Day nine, you are not a pastry. The last time we talked about how food elimination will factor into your success and why I've offered you suggested creations for each of these 21 days. But it's important to note that what I have outlined for the 21 days of food still might not be for you. Remember, you are not a pastry. There is no mold that will perfectly fit you. Therefore, many of the creation ideas in this book include additional customization options. This was done very intentionally because while I want to provide you with clear, easy to follow guidelines, I also want to provide you the freedom to step outside the guidelines when you need to. Already diagnosed with SIBO, not currently on an antibiotic, and your doctor has advised you to remain low FODMAP? All right, then don't eat the avocado. Recently diagnosed with diverticulitis and your doctor is telling you less fats and animal-based products, more fiber? Well, then great. Some of the creations would pair nicely with a brown rice. Go for it. I could give a hundred examples like this, but the bottom line is that you must listen to your own body first and foremost. And I'm not just talking about these 21 days, but for the rest of your life. Okay. So there you have it. That is how short day nine is. It is the idea and the message that I'm passing along to you that you are not a pastry. There is no mold that you are going to fit into. And I think the reason that it was so important for me to include this in the book is because I want you to feel empowered. If you know that brown rice is okay for you or that broccoli is not okay for you or any other thing is good or not good for you, then I want you to feel empowered to move forward with what both your doctor and your gut is telling you is right for you. Remember, an easy way to do this if you're not fully sure is to just keep meticulous notes in that journal and you will be able to see patterns of the things that are working and are not working. But no matter what, you are not a pastry and you do not need to fit into any mold. That's it for day nine. If you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. You can find the book, A Gutsy Girl's Bible, at a gutsy girl book. Com, and I will see you again next time.